Sir Keir Starmer allegedly said the result showed the party was going backwards and believed it to be a personal rejection. Sir Keir Starmer considered resigning after the crushing defeat in the Hartley Pool by-election in 2021, according to a new biography of the Labour League. Nearly two and a half years later, Sir Keir is now tipped to become the next Prime Minister with a poll lead far ahead of Rishi Sunak's Tories. But the by-election loss in May 2021 in the County Durham constituency was a bitter blow to Sir Keir and his top team as the party had held the seat since it was created in 1970. A new book on the Labour leader, serialised in The Times, suggests that the Hoban and St Pancras MP told close aides in the immediate wake of the by-election that he was going to quit, before being persuaded otherwise. Chris Ward, a former close aide, told biographer Tom Baldwin, Keir kept saying that he felt he would have to go, that the result showed the party was going backwards and he saw it as a personal rejection. I told him it was far too soon for that kind of thing, but it was a rocky few hours. Sir Keir, who is quoted in the book, reflected on the defeat. I'm not fulfilling some lifelong dream here. I could happily work in the bookshop or something, he says. According to the book, Sir Keir's wife Vic was among those who urged him not to act too hastily. Another key figure who helped keep Sir Keir in his post was Morgan McSweeney, who remains Labour's highly influential director of campaigns. The by-election in question, triggered by the resignation of Labour MP Mike Hill, was held on May 6, 2021 just over a year after Sir Keir was elected Labour leader. The Tories, still riding high after Boris Johnson's 2019 general victory, won handsomely, with Jill Mortimer taking 51.9% of the vote, up 23% on two years earlier. By contrast, Labour candidate Paul Williams took 28.7%, with the party's vote-sharing plunging by 9%.